gotta carve up for that game. <laughs> You don't know how you want to see how I do it. All right, keep it together, guys. Keep it together. We are almost there. Okay. All right. Are there two of them? No, you got to say it to the camera, guys. Okay. Wrap it up for Tyler. Tyler, you got to say what you said to the camera. I love Tyler. I love Gus. Laptop down, please. How do I get rid of the How do I get rid of the top bar? I don't want that top bar there. I press the thingy. Uh, it press. should be like a, a no. bulb number six That's or something. Not. No, press. That's not it. <laughs> <laughs> press the bulb number five. He's pretty. Why do you He's pretty. He's right still like the whole point. Oh. Okay. He's pretty. Okay. pretty back. All right, let's give uh, Tyler undivided attention. <laughs> so my question <laughs> Are you going to dye your hair blue? Yeah, probably. Oh. My <laughs> question is, which is better? Airsoft gun, gas or electric? So I put this into two different categories, or three actually. There's uh, the three price ranges, which you can see right here is one of them, hundred to three hundred dollars. This one's three hundred to five hundred, and this one's five hundred plus. Now I split them into the gas blowback and then electric. Now, let's look at electric first. So, we have this first gun here, the Colt M4 CQB. It's $150. It's in the 100 to 300 price range. FPS is feet per second. That was 365. Rounds per second was 15. I had joules, which is like how hard it shoots or how hard the impact is, was 1.2. Range in feet is 192. Uh, and then weight is 5.97 pounds. And then the material is light poly. And then there's uh, the second one in electric rifles is 380 in the second price range. That had a 400 FPS, 25 rounds per second, 1.5 joules, 300 uh, feet for the range, 5.7 pounds, so a little bit lighter. And it was made of high grade aluminum. And then for the high end for electric, that one cost $1,500, which is a lot. And that is the Umbrella Armory's TriTac LMG. That is electric. Uh, it shoots 450 feet per second, 30 rounds a second. And then shoots 1.4 joules, does 225 feet for the range, and is a lot heavier at 7.2 pounds. And it uses a combination of aluminum and polymer. And then I also have the gas blowback. There's the Matrix M4. <laughs> that costs 185 And then it's all red, so it's terrible. 380 FPS, 20 rounds per second. 1.5 joules, which is actually slightly better than the cheap end of electric. Well, th this, the cheap end of gas blowback entirely is better than the cheap end on electric. I'll get into that in, I'll get into that in a second. But it weighs, it weighs like a little bit more than the electric LMG. Then you got the $500 M4, which is the EMG, whatever that says. Uh, has pretty good FPS, 385, 23 rounds per second, 1.7 joules, 305 feet, and like about six pounds. Then we got the $1,500 M4, which is an EMG Strike Industries. That does 405 FPS, 25 rounds per second. As the highest uh, joules out of any of the guns I looked at, which was 1.9. Uh, it could do 350 feet, which is the furthest out of any gun. And it weighs the least at 4.93 pounds. <laughs> and then here, down here are two graphs that I made. Uh, the one on the left hand side over there is for the electric rifle feet per second, just showing a chart, uh, showing that the, like the price range, the higher the price is, the higher the FPS goes. And we see the same thing for the gas blowback, but it's much closer together, so it's not really worth paying much more because you're not getting that much more. And then we got another little chart our little kind of chart that I made. And this one is showing the electric side and gas blowback. 
the max amount of FPS or the gun that had the highest was the Crytac LMG at 450 FPS, which is pretty good. That's you're paying fifteen hundred dollars for four hundred fifty, which is a lot, but it can go a long way. Then the least amount of FPS was the Colt M4 at 365, which was the lowest out of any gun. And then the average FPS, which was 405, which is actually where what the middle range at 300 to 500 price range, that's just about where that middle gun was at about 400 FPS. So that's showing that if you want the most average rifle based on FPS for electric, you should get the Crytac uh, Trident Mark II, which was the middle price range at $380. And then I also did the max, min, and average rate of fire. The LMG, once again, had the highest at 30 rounds per second. The Colt had the least at 15 rounds per second. And then the average for electric rifle was 23.3 rounds per second. And then for gas blowback, we have the EMG Strike, which was the most expensive one having 405 feet per second, minimum was 380 feet per second from the Matrix M4, which is significantly higher than the cheap end on electric, and is just, a, that's a pretty good rifle. If you're going for a cheap end, you get a pretty good performance. The average was about 390, uh, so it's really, you're really getting picky if you want gas blowback, you can't really get too picky about the feet per second because they're all pretty close. The max, min, and average rate of fire, you have 25 rounds per second for the most expensive gas blowback, 20 rounds per second for the cheapest, which is the Matrix M4, and the average was slightly lower than electric at 22.6. Here, one sec. We are right almost done, but let's listen to Tyler and let him finish his uh, presentation here. So I got, some, I got some pictures to show you what they look like. So these are the electric ones. That is the cheap one. That's the Colt M4. I have that one. This is the Crytac Trident, which was the middle range. Have that one as well. And then this was the most expensive one at 1575. It's the Umbrella Armory Crytac LMG. And then we got the gas blowbacks. They look, they don't look too much different, but we got the cheap one, which I forgot to put the name on. That's the middle, 500, and then we got the most expensive one there. Where do you go? Yeah. Yeah. That's Any it. questions for Tyler? Good job, Tyler. Good job. Yeah. Thanks, Tyler. All right, Tyler. Thanks for your time this yeah. morning. It was fun. Yeah. Yeah. What? You guys have a great rest of your semester.